21,089, three times, uh, not three times, four boxes of Trilogy 22-23. We've got a Suzuki Generations for Montreal, and we've got a Generations the six ninety nine of Cam Neely for Boston. We've got a rookie auto to four forty nine of Smith for the Coyotes, and we got a four ninety nine for Minnesota Zuccarello. We got a rendition of Bobby Brink for Philly and for Philly to 299 generations of J V R. We've got number to 199 Walsh for the Devils. And we've got number to 99 Valeno for the Red Wings. We've got a generation of Lindros for Philly. 149 for Buffalo. Owen Power. 149. And we got a rookie premieres jersey of Rossi for Minnesota. And we've got a 999 for Boston McLaughlin. Boston McLaughlin. Oh, we've got a rendition of Korzak for Vegas. And we got a 99 Okachuk for the Devils. 99 Oka Chuck for the Devils. We've got number 2499 for the Sens of Stutzel. And a 99 Generations jersey for the Preds, Roman Yossi. Well, I guess there's nothing else behind there. There you go. Generations of JVR for Philly. And a 9.99 call, yeah, Chonic, for the Coyotes. We've got number to 4.49 for Pittsburgh Pustinen. 4.49 Pittsburgh Pustinen. We've got a Rene generation to 6.99 for the Preds. We got a Quinn for Buffalo uh, renditions and a seven ninety nine Matty Buneers for Seattle. Matty Buneers. We've got number two ninety nine for the Leafs, Shalgren, and number to twenty five Lafontaine for Carolina. La. Team. Two more boxes to go in the trilogy. Let's go. I'm glad you guys like the uh, the mini chancer. As I said, that was our first foray into it. We've got an autograph, Yanni Gord for Seattle. We've got for Vegas, a $7.99 core, Zach. The funny thing is we actually grade quite a few cards and most of our grades probably average 9.5. It's more about how you handle them. Renditions of Johnson for the Jackets. We've got a Generations to 299 of Bertuzzi for the Red Wings. 
And a LaFontaine for Carolina. We've got number 299, Bordello for the Sharks. So we've graded a ton of uh, ton of cards. I said the majority would be nine fives or nines. We got a 75 future Tomasino for Nashville. We got a rendition of McBain for the Coyotes. And we've got a Bobby Brink to 199 for Philly. Bobby Brink. We've got number to 499 hints for the stars. And we've got a triple relics number to 35 patch of Mercer, Heesher, and Hughes. See, here, here's my honest opinion. If I felt that a lot of our cards come back seven, seven and a half, eight, eight and a half, I feel like it'd be a big problem and we'd be, uh, we would be scolded on that rightfully so. But we have done a ton of Young Guns. We got a Generations for Boston of Neely, a Jersey of Darlene for Buffalo, and a three ninety nine Pearson. For the Detroit Red Wings. Well, it was more of a statement, Silver. Uh, what was it? Silver Tin Man. It was more of a statement. I don't think it was a question. What was your question then? If you asked in a nicer way and said, hey, out of curiosity, how does the average amount of cards grade for you? And I gave you the answer. Then I feel like that would be a question. Generations of Latang for Pittsburgh. And we got a 399 Walsh for the Devils. We've got a rookie auto of Castellich to auto out of 449. 449. And we got for Seattle to 499, Yanni Gord. Yanni Gord. Rendition of Pearson for the Red Wings. And a rendition to 799 of Wright for Seattle. We've got a 9.99 fix Wolonski. And we got LA number to 99 Byfield. How was that not nice though? Well, literally read your last ones when you said haha bet they grade not very good. Obviously I'm emphasizing the not very good. That's not what you said. I don't think that's nice. Because they do grade good. Generations of Tomasino for the Preds. And we've got a 99 Fix Wolonski. And we got a 499 Kent Johnson for the Jackets. Kent Johnson. Blue Jackets. And we got a 799 Dostal for the Ducks. There we go.